So median, median means this is one type of central value. Median means the middle most value or the value which divides the total data into two equal parts. The value which divides the total data into two equal parts that is called median. Simply in one word what we can say median means middle most value. Middle most value of data which divides the data into two equal parts. The data into two equal parts. Which divides the data into two equal parts. Now coming to how to calculate median? To calculate median of given data. When raw data is given, series of numbers are given. Series of numbers are given. We can call this one as ungrouped data, raw data. When it is given, median has two possibilities. One is whenever the number of values given in series are odd, odd number of values. The number of values are given in series are odd. For example, three values are given. Or five values are given. So here, the third value is middle most, very clear. How you will get the third value? The number of values 5, odd number, 5 plus 1 by 2, 6 by 2, third value will be the median, one median you will have. That is, n plus 1 by 2, when n is odd. n plus 1 by 2, the value. So if you have 5 values, 5 plus 1, 6 by 2, third value will be median. For example, if n is even, then you will have two possibilities. For example, six values are there. Then you will have two values. Three and four are middlemost values. That means n plus one by two value, comma, n plus one by two plus one. Or in another way, what we can say, if n is even, then simply we can write six number of values are 6 then 6 by 2, 6 by 2 plus 1 very easily n by 2 comma n by 2 plus 1 values 2 values n by 2 value and n by 2 plus 1 value when n is odd you will have 1 median when n is even you will have 2 values 2 medians this is for series of numbers given just some 10 or 14 values are given. When class intervals are given, continuous data is given, we can say that one as grouped data or with class intervals, with CI and the frequency. Then median will be calculated like this. Median is equal to L plus N by 2 minus M by small f. So, this part now we are going to use into C will have L plus N by 2 minus M by F into C. So, L plus N by 2 minus L, M by F means here what is L represent? L represent lower limit of median class lower limit of median class and F represent frequency of median class frequency of median class next N represent sum of frequency sum of frequency. So here class interval C is median class. Median class means 
while prepare while calculating median for group data along with class intervals class intervals frequency you will prepare cumulative frequency so by adding all frequencies first value plus second value answer first plus second plus third first plus second plus third plus fourth opposite fourth value like that you will find cumulative frequency the median class is one the median class is one which contains n by 2 value first you will calculate n by 2 100 you will get 100 in which class you will have in which cumulative frequency you will find that class is called median class median class frequency we are going to take as f median class rate limit we are taking as l we will discuss very clearly about median class in your problem this is just a formula introduction Next, we are going to discuss problem. In that, you can easily understand what is median class. If you identify median class, automatically you will get all the values. Okay. Median means very simply, in one word, what we can say, that is middle most value. Are you clear? Calculate median for the following data. So, we need to calculate median for these two data which are simply series of numbers raw data ungrouped data when series of numbers or raw data are given like this we know how to find median coming to the first a bit the given data is 6 15 25 30 8 16 18 First, what you need to do, first to arrange the data in one order, either increasing or decreasing order. First, we are arranging the data in increasing order, like this. 6, next highest value. 8, next highest value. 15, 6, 8, 15, 16, 18, Next, uh, 21, 24, 25, 30. Arrange them in order like this, either increasing or decreasing order, from least to highest. Now, the number of values, how many values you are having count? Number of values, n equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 9 odd number. If number of values are odd, then median is median is median is n plus 1 by 2th value. n plus 1 by 2th value. n plus 1 by 2 means 9 plus 1 by 2th value. 9 plus 1 by 2. 9 plus 1. 10. 10 by 2, 5. So, fifth value is median. Count what is fifth value. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This will be the median. Median equal to 18. The next step, the another way, the simple way without formula is Simply cancel one one element that side and this side. The number which is left over at the end that will be the median. What I am saying? Cancel one number this side, another number this side. Again cancel one number this side, another number this side. Again cancel one number this side, another number this side. Again cancel one number this side, another number this side. Which will be left over like this that will be the middlemost value that is median. This is another way without applying formula. So this is our first problem coming to the second one. B bit. In B bit what is given data? First note down. In B bit the given data is 20, 18, 16, 18, 25, 30, 
first arrange them in order in order you need to arrange that is from least to highest the least value among these the least value among these is 12 right 12 next least 16 next least 18 next least number 20 next least number 26 next least 28 next least 35 next least 40 next least 42 next least 48 The highest value will be at the end. Now count how many values are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So number of values we are having is ten. Then median will be average of two middlemost values. They are n by two and n by 2 plus 1th values average by 2 so n by 2 means 10 by 2 comma 10 by 2 plus 1 values average we need to take 10 by 2 means 5th value and 6th value 10 by 2 5 5 5 5 plus 1 that means this is fifth value this is sixth value find out what is fifth value 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 these two values average will be the median 26 plus 28 by 2 26 plus 28 by 2 you will get 27 is median First, to arrange the numbers in ascending or descending order. Next, find out the number of values. If number of values are e one, then the average of two values will be the median. Because for e one numbers, you will get two middlemost values. If you want, you can check using one shortcut method which I said just now. Cancelling one one number that side and this side like this. This side one number, this side one number. This side one number, this side one number. This side one number, this side one number. This side one number, this side. So you will get two middlemost values. Average of that two middlemost values will be the median. Okay. This is the way to find median for raw data when series of numbers are given. Calculate median for the following distribution. Frequencies are given. When raw data series of numbers are given, simply we will arrange them in decreasing order. We will find out the middlemost value. If odd, we will get one middlemost. If it is even, you will get two middlemost. But when x and f are given, when frequencies are given, how to find the median? For this, you need to prepare a table like this. X given x values and frequency <coughs> and cumulative frequency. Cumulative frequency. Cumulative frequency means. adding frequencies i will tell you how to add the frequencies how to find that cumulative frequencies we will discuss in detail okay so first x values are 12 18 23 28 34 38 45 60 okay Okay. So frequencies are three, seven, twelve, twenty-eight, thirty-two, eighteen, twelve, eight. Given frequencies as it is written. So given data, a captain table. They are given in horizontal, we written in vertical. Nothing new we did now. Now how to find cumulative frequencies? Cumulative frequency means first value will be three only. First is three. The second value will be 
3 plus 7. What is 3 plus 7? That will be the second value. 10. Next value 10 plus 12. 10 plus 12, 22. Next value 22 plus 28. 22 plus 28. 30, 50. Next value 50 plus 32. 50 plus 32. 82. Next value 82 plus 18. 82 plus 18. What you will get? 100, right? Next 100 plus 12. 100 plus 12. 112. plus 8. 120. So if you add these frequencies also, you have to get 120. Then this cumulative frequency is correct. If these two values are not matching, then we did some mistakes in calculating cumulative frequency. So this value is treated as N. This is N. N. Now find out median by using this formula n plus 1 by tooth value tooth corresponding x corresponding x n plus 1 by tooth value in cm to corresponding x that means I will tell you I will explain very clearly how to get that median value? I will tell you. What is that? 120 plus 1 by 2. 121 by 2. 120 by 2 is uh, 60. Here, 120 plus 1, 121 by 2, 60.5. What I am saying? 60.5 in CF value will get. 60.5 can you get in first 10? No. In first 22 numbers do you have 60? No. In first 50 you want to get 60. In first 82. In 82 do you find 60? If you count from 1 to 82 do you have that 60? Yes. So this is called median class. Median class. So in this corresponding x value, so here count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Fifth value 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So corresponding x value will be the median. 60.5 is in C of 82. The corresponding x value, corresponding x value is how much? 34. So finally, median of given data is 34. Median of given data is 34. Like this, one can easily evaluate median when x and frequencies are given. Okay. So now, the frequency distribution of weights in grams of mangoes of okay. air. Given variety is given below. Calculate the median. So we need to calculate median, but this is grouped data. Class intervals are given. Not like raw data. Group. Some groups are there. The weights in grams 410 to 419 grams, 14 apples are there. 14 mangoes are there. 420 to 429 grams, 20 mangoes are there. Like that given. So for this, prepare a table like this first class intervals. 410 to 419. 422, 429, 432, 439, 442, 449, 450 to 459, 462, 469, 472, 479. So these are the values given. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, okay. Frequencies. 
we will uh, take this one as class intervals, this one as frequency. This is frequency. Number of mangoes means frequency, number of values. 14, 20, 42, 54, 45, 18, 7. Now, cumulative frequency. See, cumulative frequency. I said how to find cumulative frequency. So that cumulative frequency we need to find. First, cumulative frequency is first one 14. Second one you will get by adding these two. 14 plus 20. 14 plus 20. 34. Next value you need to add these two. 34 plus 40. 76. Adding this one and this one you will get this. Next add 76 and 54. 76 and 54. 76 plus 4, 80. 80 plus 50, 130. Okay. Next. 130 plus 45, 175. 175 plus 80, 170, 185, 180, 193. 183. 193 plus 7, 200. 193 plus 7, 200. So, this total frequency is 200. This we treat it as capital N. Capital N is 200. Now, we need to find N by 2 value. N by 2 value we need to find. N by 2 is, N by 2 is 200 by 2. 200 by 2 is, 100. Find out where 100 is. Find out where 100 is CF. In which class you will get this 100? In 14 do you get 100? No. Up to 34 you won't get. Up to 76 you won't get. In 130 you will have 100. So this class is called median class. This one is called median class. This is median class. Now, for finding median, we use this formula. L plus N by 2 minus M by small f into C. So here, L is lower limit of Median class. Median class lower limit. So this is median class. Its lower limit you will get its lower limit and its previous upper limit average. These two average. These two average will be lower limit of median class. 440 plus 439 by 2. 440 plus 439 by 2. You will get 439.5 L is 439.5 L Now M is M is Preceding frequency of Preceding cumulative frequency of Median class Median class before frequency That is Preceding CM of median class. What is preceding before cumulative frequency of median class? That is 76. This will be M. So, M is 76. Next, M. F. Frequency of median class. Frequency of median class. Median class frequency that, that will be this. Now we know all the values. C is class interval. Class interval. That you will get like this easily. 420 minus 410. Easily you will get that is 10. C is 10. Now median. I am going to substitute these values in this formula. So if you substitute. L plus N by 2 minus capital M by small f into C. 
L is 439.5 plus 50 minus 76 by F is frequency of median class 54. 54 into 10. If you calculate this, you will get 54 this is. You will get 443.9. Use your calculator. This will be the median. When class intervals are given like this. When class intervals are given like this, we will calculate median like this. 